Hello, my name is Kai Pata and I am the curator of the Open Society Technologies International Master Program in Tallinn University. I would like to give you a brief overview of the goals of our program and of the courses. Why we have Open Society Technologies Master Program and what this openness means here. We can do a lot of different civic uh, engagement technologies and governance technologies, but uh, what about values? This is what is the goal of our Open Society Technologies program, to teach you how to design the civic technologies with values, with the values of openness. You can see here in the middle of the program with the lilac, uh, the values that we support in open society technologies. On the horizontal line, you can see that we bring you to several design thinking uh, possibilities. And uh, around, you can see different uh, wicked problems that you need to solve when you have to develop technologies for the open society. For example, how to achieve data justice in digital governance, how to maintain social justice, how should civic society practice the societal openness, or how can everyone give back to the society. Our program is unique because we put together the social sciences, the design thinking, and the technical competences. Another idea why this Open Society Technologies program is unique. Tallinn University is supporting as its main goal, one of its main goal, the Open Society. And this program is for this. What we mean is that the knowledge how to develop and use digital governance technologies should not be only in the hands of top-down governance bodies and corporations who can pay for the development. Rather, we need to give it to the hand, hands of uh, citizen-led organizations so that uh, they can provide the missing services for the society. What are the goals of the master program? There are three big goals. The first is to give you a broad understanding of the civic society and governance of open society. Second, we want to give you experiences with value-based design of civic technologies. And third, we give you the basis for data-driven decision-making. Who will you be when you graduate as our student? Having these uh, three goals in mind, you can become an architect or analyst of civic technologies. You can also become an interaction manager in social technical civic systems. You can be a policy advisor for the open society technologies. And you can also become a so social entrepreneur in civic society. So we can see that you can be hired by governing institutions or the civic society organizations, or you can initiate startups by yourself. What are the courses that uh, we provide? One group of courses is for the goal of civic society and governance of open society competencies. We will teach you social and political theories, legal aspects of e-governance, public policy and co-creation of e-governance, social innovation and governance of responsible innovation, 
civil society and social innovations and e-governance for responsible innovation. Tallinn University is running several different uh, international master programs. And uh, in some of those courses, you will be together with the students from other master programs, for example, from the program of social innovation. In the next group, we will give you the competences of basis for data-driven decision-making. There, you will learn about data-driven decision-making and change management in organizations. You will get the first understanding of big open and linked data and the competences of data analytics with our language. Also, you will look at the security, privacy and trust issues related with the data. In the third group of courses, we provide you value-based design competences for creating civic technologies. In this group, there are a lot of practical courses, starting from collective intelligence in social technical systems, design thinking and generative research, participatory design of software systems, accessibility design, business process modeling and automatization, and ICT strategic management. And again, here you will have a chance to be together with our students of International Master Program Human, in, uh, human Interaction Technologies. Tallinn University is unique because it allows all students to develop general competences and we have developed in Tallinn University a particular course for it that is called Learning in Interdisciplinary Focused Environments, LIFE. In this course, the students themselves can initiate the projects, engage other students from other curricula to help to solve these uh, projects and they can contribute back to the society. The master program requires that you are also having the practice in uh, the field. We provide opportunities to do the practice in Estonia or you can also do the practice in the other countries. All the studies in the master programs end with the master thesis that is a research-based empirical thesis and the topics in our master theses relate with data they relate with design they relate with uh, analytical or survey-based approaches that combine these three competences the design thinking the understanding of um, governance and uh, the technical competences. And every student can also take free electives. Please, uh, if you are interested to come to our studies, then uh, we are waiting you to send your applications uh, for entering to the studies in our program. We want you to write an essay this essay should describe one challenge that you see in open society that can be solved with the technologies. We also expect you to describe what kind of master thesis you want to do and where you would want to end in the end of your studies, what profession you have in mind in the future. Please come to study with us. Our environment is international. We are able to provide you with uh, digital learning in case of uh, corona conditions. And we have experience of doing a lot of practical things together with different uh, enterprises, for example, with the civic engagement uh, companies. 
Thank you for listening.